Hello, this is Kenny from Kenny's Audiophile Record Reviews. Thank you very much for viewing my channel. Please like and subscribe if you could, as I would greatly appreciate it. This thought came to me the other day, and the thought was, if I were to construct an all-star band comprising of the members from Sergio Medes in Brazil 77 and Sergio Medes in Brazil 66, who would I choose? And this assumes that I can only choose two female singers, a drummer, a percussionist, a guitar player, and a bass player, and obviously Sergio Medes on piano keyboards. But who would I choose? This is my list. Or my choices, I should say. Sebastião Nato on bass, who started with Sergio Mendes in Brazil 66 with the Fool on the Hill album. John Pisano, a great guitarist on guitar. He appeared on the Equinox album, Fool on the Hill album, and Look Around album. Great guitarist. John Pisano on guitar. Percussionist. It comes down to Rubens Bassini and Polino da Costa. Both great percussionists. I mean, they're just, this is awesome. But I'm going to go with Polino da Costa. He's a legend. He appeared on Michael Jackson records. Um, he also appeared on Anita Baker records, uh, Roberta Flack records, just a legend. Polino da Costa on percussion. Drums. It comes down to Joao Palma and Dom Um Ramal. I'm going with Dom Um Ramal. A great drummer. Matter of fact, he, he was a great percussionist, too. He, he easily could have been percussionist on this list. He was a percussionist on some of the early Weather Report albums. A great per, a percussionist and drummer. But Dom Umar Mao on drums. That brings us to the singers. I have to choose two singers out of this, this group I have here. And I narrowed it down to Karen Phillip, Janice Hansen, Sergio Mendez's wife, Please forgive me if I'm butchering her name and not pronounce it right. I'm sorry. Christina, Bonnie Bowden, and Lanny Hall. Now, I had to quickly cross Karen Phillips' name off the list. There's just no evidence or any solo track record of her being um, a great vocalist. So I, I had to uh, uh, cross her name off the list. I'm not saying she's not a great singer, but... Compared to the other two, I had to base it on something. So she was the first one I crossed off the list. Gracina, I crossed her name off the list as well. She's a fabulous vocalist. A fabulous vocalist. Top rate. She was amazing on the Primal uh, Roots album. Her, her vocal uh, performance on that album was amazing. Lanny Hall, or Lonnie Hall makes the list. That's obvious. She's probably the best of the lot. That brings it down for the second vocalist to Bonnie Bowden and Janice Hansen. A difficult decision because to me it's like if, if Lottie Hall is number one, Bonnie Bowden and Janice Hansen are 2A and 2B. They're just that close and it's very difficult to distinguish between the two in terms of their talent base because they're both fabulous. But if I had to choose between the two, I would choose Bonnie Bowden, as great as, as, as Janice Hansen was. I'm going to choose Bo uh, Bonnie Bowden. So that's my list. What's yours? Please leave your comments in the comment section below. Please like and subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. Thank you very much for viewing my channel. God bless and love and peace to all.